uh, the the one I watched on like Friday or Thursday was um, this one. Strange. What's it called? Bait film trailer. This. This strange thing. It was only made a few years ago. Evening, Mrs. Peters. Evening, Martin. Lovely day. All inside us bound in Ignore the music. There's, there's no music in it. Ignore the music. Music ruins it. You, what's on? Nothing much. Get him, Manny. Not now. Paul and Silas thought they were love. It's. I was watching it with Lynn and she gave up and it said it's uh, wanky and it's the th sort of thing I would normally slag off. Yo, what's on? Nothing much. Get him, Manny? Not now. Right. She says this is the sort of arty thing that I would normally slag off. Want to leave your truck outside. What are you doing, Martin? It's between me and the clamping company. Hold on. Right. Um, she says all this sort of fake scratches and all that. You know, why has why he done it like that? Just done it because it looks all kind of arty. So I think it's dubbed there, I I think it's it. See what I liked about it is it feels. See, the, like, look at these angles. Look at it. It's like something. I don't know. I, this, I'm probably talking shit when I say this, but some sort of German expressionist sort of thing. These. Nothing much. Get him, Manny. Not enough. You know, as if um, this film, it might not look much to you, but this really influenced Hitchcock and all the rest of it. You know, just films when they made it at these angles. Uh, this is the first time this was done. You know, some shite for the, the 30s or something. But it isn't it. It was made a few years ago. It's obviously got a kind of wanky white yet, right? But it's got all these scratches and film... Uh, like defects there. And production wise, I mean, I think this is all genuine. Um, I don't know how the fuck you can. Anyway, the person who. What it is, it's about a kind of wee holiday. Um, it's a wee coastal town, and it's about the sort of friction between folk who stay there and the visitors, the tourists. Um, Kind of. Anyway, I looked it up because I thought, see if this has been filmed on a normal camera and then this has all been sort of digitally put on all these sort of, you know, to make it look like film. I'm going to blow a fucking fuse. But, um, no, the person who made it filmed it on one of these old as fuck cameras with this film. But it's, it's, it's weird, it's all, it's got a, that student -y way, yeah, but student -y stuff, saying student -y sounds uh, bad, because a lot of student stuff I can imagine is very, very good these days. You know, like if you just saw, look at somebody's thing on YouTube, you don't know who the fuck they are, but it's all really well made, because everything looks cracking, and you can get all the lenses and the cameras and all the things you can do with it. But, like, you know, things like this, look at this, that there. See, see just that angle, see just... There's something about that, you know, this, see all this here? Or this space up here, there's something about... It's got a kind of, just point a camera in that direction. You know, it's no kind of, maybe I should bring it down a wee bit, you know, maybe have the nose at the middle, with the kind of vertical sort of middle, and have something at the left, and maybe put a picture frame there, or uh, you know, something like that. And the so posh, I honestly thought he was speaking German. <laughs> Losing your... As slightly. Any disgrace you are, sell it! Get out! It's got a, a, you know, a slightly wanky with it, because it's no, it's not just some authentic thing that was made in the past. And, and I, I said to, I said to uh, Lynn, maybe it's meant to be like this, look. The dubbing's a little rough, but I know it's a light, I like, I like that about it. 
it's it, it, it's just it just it manages to not quite cross into annoying for me somehow. I I can imagine if I if I got out the other side of the bed that morning, I would go like, ah fuck this pretentious fucking shite. You know, just it depends. Um. So, I said to she says, you know why why is it like that? She said, why you tell me. Because you normally slag things like this off, we decisions like this. Tell me, why does it look like that? Why have they done it like that? If not, make it look all kind of art, you know, that. What's the purpose? And I said, well, all right, well, what, 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 go tell me. Well, just hold on this wee second. Just hold on. Go tell me. If you just hold on, I'll tell you. If I I concede, as if, I, as if I'd made it. I concede that a lot of the reason is because the person likes the look of things like that. But that's because maybe when when they've seen that, it was that was the that was authentic thing. The thing actually was made like that. In the fucking thirties or something, or the forties or the fifties. But but maybe Maybe, just maybe, it's a clash between, it's a bit of a clash between the locals, the local sort of community and the way things were in this new way. The tourists, people kind of ruining, you know, the old way of life. Somebody's boat used to be a fishing boat and now it's just to take fucking, uh, go on uh, booze cruises or whatever you fucking call them. So in that sense, it's sort of showing a new way of life in an old format. Give it an old feeling, do you see? To give that sense of, you know, it looks like some old thing made in the 30s, yet there's somebody with a fucking uh, smartphone. clash between, you know, if you want to see it that way. But it's probably because they just like the fucking look at it. But um, I liked it. I liked it. There's not much tape. I liked it.